Hey everybody, Tom here, and today I want to teach you how to set up a two-player game of Azul. Won't be too hard to set up a different player count either. Um, but Azul is a really awesome, super fast to set up abstract game that I've been loving a lot recently. This was kind of a, a good hit around uh, the holiday season for my family and stuff like that. So, woo here we go. Okay, so we're going to crack open the box. We've got our rule book here. Really simple, small rule book. It's good. And then at the top... We've got four different player boards, so this game plays two to four players. Uh, we're going to be setting up, like I said, a two-player game, so I'm just going to grab two of these boards and take the others out, and we're almost done setting up. Uh, what we have in this bag is all of the different um, tiles you can see in there, and so we'll be grabbing those in just a minute, so we'll just take out that bag, and this has a really nice recess in this insert for these circle tiles that are called factories. Um, and what we need is we need a number of factories depending on the number of players. And if I remember right, it's your number of players times two plus one. Uh, so we need five for this. Now, I'm a math geek, so that's fun for me to know that. Uh, but you can take a look here, and it will show you... Yeah, it just shows you right here. In a two-player game, we need five tiles. All right, so we need those five factory tiles and none others. And I'm going to go ahead in this bag... Um, and grab, uh, we need the first player kind of a token there, and then two cubes. These are going to be score markers. Now I'll point out that uh, this box does have a place to put the that one tile in there, uh, but I store this game vertically and it often would fall out, so I've just been keeping it in the little bag so that uh, what had happened one time is it fell under the insert and it was hard for me to find again. Anyway, we have everything out of the box that we need, so I'm just going to go ahead and put the rest of the stuff back in the box, like that. We'll get it off camera, and now we're just going to set, oh, I love that noise, everything up. So, two player mats, like that. Let me see, get them on camera nicely. Now, these player mats, mats are identical, and they have two sides. Uh, this is a side that's a variant, but this side over here with the color showing is the normal side. So I'm going to go ahead and grab these. And because they're identical, it would be really tough, I think, to follow in my gameplay video uh, which player is which. So to distinguish the two colors, I'm going to use my <laughs> famous colored papers that I use um, also in my gameplay of Otis. And I'm just going to go ahead and set the player boards on top like that, so that it looks like they're slightly different, so that we can follow on camera who is whom. No, who is who is who? Who is whom? I'm usually pretty good with who and whom. Whose is who? Whom and whose? Yep, there you go. Language arts with um, Tom here. Okay, so we're going to get our two-player board set out, and we're going to take our scoring markers, and they just go up here on the top corner at zero, and then we're going to put this zero um, or this one in the center, and we're just going to go ahead and surround that with these different factory tiles like that. And then to start off the game, we're going to take our bag of tiles, shuffle them up, and every factory is going to get four. So I'm just going to go ahead and grab, oh, I grabbed too many, like that, and grab four. And yep, you're thinking it, we'll say it, these look just like starbursts. Um, so be careful when you're playing around the kids, that they don't go into their mouths. Um, but very cool looking tiles, I love the, the clanking noise they make, it's a very happy moment for us. And, hey, there you have it. <laughs> we just set up Azul for two players. Um, it was that simple. So, if you are interested in seeing how this game plays, um, go ahead and click on the link in the description of this video, and I'm going to go ahead and just play two-player game, um, Blue Tom versus the Red Tom. And I hope to see you there, and thanks for watching this quick setup video. Bye!